I'm here at HPE Discover with Ozer, GM of the Aruba Meridian Group, and asset tracking is something that Aruba announced here at yes. Discover. Why is that something you guys are interested in? Well, uh, let's step back to our social lives maybe a little bit, right? So nowadays, we're not finding it too hard or too time consuming to discover things around us. It starts outdoors with restaurants and everything else and gas stations and cars, right? And nowadays we're not too uncomfortable with tagging our personal items at home, right? Laptop bags and keychains and everything else. So we looked at our technology, we looked at the Urban Wireless LAN technology, uh, which now incorporates Bluetooth by default. So if you're building a Urban Wireless network, right, those wireless LANs that we all love to connect to, if you're building those, you're actually building a Bluetooth network as well. Right, it comes built in. Okay. So we said, why don't we create these tags with powerful radios, with years of battery life, and have our APs listen to them and figure out where they are. Because we thought that as people move around, imagine a retail organization or a healthcare organization, you're always on the move, you're trying to find pallets of products, you're trying to find bedside equipment that are relatively expensive. It would be a shame if you lose them or if you spend 30 minutes trying to find them instead of serving your customers or patients. We said, why don't we make it easier for people to find it using a mobile app, right? So we already have a pretty good mobile SDK solution as part of Urban Meridian, enabling people to discover where they are, put a blue dot where they are, just like we are doing at this event, uh, discover things around them. Well, we're just adding a piece of uh, next generation technology where we the tag the items that we tag can also be placed on the same map so I'm on the go I know where I am in reference to assets that I'm trying to find as well so again we learned from our social experiences and we wanted to translate to a big large enterprise scale for large healthcare organizations and large retailers so Maybe you already answered this by, by saying because Bluetooth is built into the Aruba switches, but, but why, why Bluetooth versus, say, RFID or, or some other tracking solution? First of all, it's cost. So uh, building the tags using the Bluetooth technology is relatively, you know, the amount of um, dollars you need to spend on building the tags is relatively low. So that keeps, that translates to customer cost as well. It's a widely adapted technology by the smartphones. So. Uh, we actually, as part of the solution set, we offer a free uh, configuration app that runs on an iOS device, uses the Bluetooth radios on the iPhones or the iPads to configure, name, label, uh, change the status of those tags. Um, so it was a readily available technology that's a low cost adapt. And compared to Wi-Fi tags that offer similar um, accuracy of tracking and latency of tracking, uh, it actually offers three to four times more battery life. So it was kind of a no-brainer. And so what types of things are, are you guys looking at asset tracking in these scenarios? Because, I mean, obviously there's already Bluetooth in everybody's phone and iPad and yeah. probably even in their laptop at this point. That's right. Uh, and, and I mean, and there's RFID in many of those things too. So, so what types of assets are you looking at tracking in a solution like this? Yeah, so it's definitely unconnected things. Uh, think about uh, bedside equipment in, um, in healthcare facilities. Um, they tend to move a lot uh, between different patient rooms and etc. And uh, apparently healthcare organizations spend a lot of time every six months to 12 months per regulatory reasons to find these devices, service them, clean them, make sure that they're ready for production um, uh, to take care of patients. So and they spend days trying to find exactly where they are because nobody can remember where they left them. <laughs> and there are hundreds of these devices. So we're looking at productivity gains of uh, many days overall during the course of a year, uh, trying to find high value bedside equipment or just beds themselves sometimes, honestly, in a healthcare facility that costs $1,000 or above, right? These are high valued items. It would be a shame to lose them. Some of our healthcare customers actually told us that they over order, you know, they order 10% extra equipment because they know that they will eventually lose them. So there's also savings up front, right? So if you have an asset tracking solution already in place 
and using the existing Aruba wireless infrastructure and not setting up a separate infrastructure, then you're not over-ordering. So you start saving dollars immediately. So that's the healthcare use case. And in retail, it's all about save, you know, serving customers. So big, high-valued product. It's here somewhere in this big retail place. The customer wants to buy it now. And instead of spending 10 minutes trying to find it and maybe losing that customer, you're finding in a couple of minutes. So that's, that's the value prop there. Those are, those are both good value props. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well I look forward to seeing this as it evolves. Absolutely, thanks for having me. Thanks.